in his time of dying, and they left him there. The people laughed at him and left him for, to die in misery. And yet he said, Father, forgive them, for they know not what they do. I'm afraid our world would call him a fool. But in my heart I know that Jesus Christ is wisdom. It is to him we must go to find it. But it's not something one finds overnight. It is a lifetime of seeking. It takes prayer and study and talking with each other, listening to each other, and experiencing, and others experiencing, even if it is a child that we're listening to. And it takes caring for each other. It takes forgiving each other and reaching out to the world around us with compassion and with, the, with love, too. It does. You know, over the last weeks, I've had the opportunity to sit with Ed in his last days of his life. And one of the things we really looked at is what is life about? What does it mean to live in the world? And one of the things I saw that Ed did was he built his life day by day. Now in West Africa, I built a house. We built it out of mud bricks. We made the bricks, we took the mud, we got, we took the dirt, laterite, we got it all muddy, we put it in a mold, and we let it drop. And then we built it brick by brick. You know, you really gotta be careful how you build that house. You've gotta make sure that the walls are straight, that you know what the design is, and as you build it, your house becomes a beautiful place. We build our lives too, day by day. Each day that we live, we're building our lives. How are we building them? With anger, with regret, with wanting to get even, with holding a grudge, with selfishness, well, I can tell you those walls are not straight. They're bending in all directions. But remember, every single day of your life, you're building your life. The walls of who you are. The beauty of who you can be. Now, if we build on our own, I'm very afraid that the walls will crumble at any time. But if we build in the love of Christ, if we turn to Christ's wisdom, and we build our lives minute by minute, breath by breath, day by day, action by action, every single action we take, every single day we live, the way in which we treat each other, the way in which we turn to Christ to see what we need to be doing is the way that we build our lives and the lives that we have. Now I think that in Christ, and only in Christ, is there wisdom. Remember that it was built into the very foundations of the universe. It's woven into the fabric of all there is. And in Christ, it is open to us. Build your life, breath by breath, moment by moment, day by day, action by action. Build it in love, build it in forgiveness, build it in patience, and build it in compassion for all who are around us. For so Christ built his life, such that even as he hung on the cross, he could say, Father, forgive them, for still do I love them. Build your life such, and you will live in such a glorious place that all the time you will find joy. Amen. Amen. Thank you, Carla. We will not have our scholarship presentation.